This is your seat, Adrikins. I saved it for you, right in front of me. Thanks, Chloe. Uh, hey, Adrian. You're friends with Chloe then, huh? Uh, uh. Hmm. Hey, what's that all about? The brats that <laughs> sat here yesterday need a little attitude adjustment. I'm just commanding a bit of respect, that's all. I think that's really necessary. <laughs> You've got a lot to learn about school culture, Adrikins. Watch the master. Oh, yeah? Wouldn't you like to be a superhero and go out and fight monsters and villains? Totally. I'm not scared of anyone. Why? Oh, no reason. <gasps> hey, what are you doing? Oh, uh, I... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> okay, I get it. Good job, you three. Very funny. No, no, I was just trying to take this off. Oh, really? Uh. <laughs> You're friends with Chloe, right? Why do people keep saying that? Hmm. Uh. Now do you see what I mean about respect? Uh. I know I've seen him somewhere before. <gasps> of course! He's the son of my fave fashion designer, Gabriel Lacrest! Daddy's boy, teen supermodel, and Chloe's buddy? <laughs> Forget it. Why didn't you tell him it was Chloe's idea? I've known Chloe since I was a little kid. I know she's not perfect, but I can't throw her under the bus. She's like my only friend. I'm Nino, and it's time for you to make some new friends, dude. <laughs> Where's Adrian? I don't know. Uh, hey, Nino. Uh, isn't Adrian with you? Uh, tell her you'll both be better off without me. We'll be better off without me. Huh? Ah, this trip is turning out to be a lot more interesting than I thought. Turn up the volume. Yeah, uh, without him, I mean, we don't need Adrian to hang out at the zoo. Of course we do, you Dumbo. Of course we do, you Dumbo. I, I mean, wasn't he supposed to come? Don't you want to wait for him? Tell her you wanted to be alone with her. Not yet. What was that? You're right. We'll wait. <laughs> no, what are you talking about? Don't wait for me. I'm not coming. Look what Daddy's brought you. Only the finest for my baby. Whoa! Look at the size of that piece of meat it's eaten! Typical diet for a feline species requiring the strength to run at speeds in excess of 60 miles per hour. 60 miles per hour? Is that all? I thought panthers were much faster than that. I bet I could beat it in a race. Impossible. No human being could compete with my panther. Is that so? What place did your cat come in at the county athletics tournament? I came in first place. You can't possibly compare yourself to my panther, kiddo. No need to. I'm obviously the better looking one. Hey, kitty kitty. How about a little race with me, huh? Last one's a rotten egg. Let's see. With a six feet per second wind behind you and the sun at 45 degrees to the northeast, I don't think you'd be a rotten egg. You'd be lunch. Your friend's right, kiddo. Now please leave. She needs peace and quiet while she eats. You're stressing her out. Aw, stressed out, are we, Miss Panthy? You're talking about a wild animal, dude. <laughs> Leave now, or I'll have you kicked out of the zoo immediately. Come on, Max. Let's leave that poor little kitty alone with its angry babysitter. <laughs> Unleashing the animal in each of us. I like that idea. Go ahead, my little evil Akuma. Fly off and take control of that zookeeper. He's sure taking his time, huh? He's not coming, is he? Repeat after me. Yes, he is, but first I wanted to take this opportunity to... Yes, he is, but first I wanted to take this opportunity to... Tell you that I love you, Marinette. Tell you that I... Uh, I... Love a girl, but I don't know how to tell her. Hey, what are you doing? You do? Well, I can help you with that. You could? You, giving uh, expert advice on how to tell someone you love them? Can't wait to hear this one. Can't wait to hear this one. What? <gasps> uh, can't wait to hear uh, about this lucky girl. Oh, yeah. Tell her it's you. It's you. <laughs> 
best friend, Dahlia. What? Alia? Awesome! No! No! It's not awesome! I can fix up a date for you guys. Say what? Seriously? You didn't even ask me first. Uh-uh. Nino's like a brother to me. Ugh. No! End of discussion. He's gonna be so sad if you don't. Did you say something? I said it'd be so sad if you didn't tell her. Miraculous before you run out of air. Dream on, bubbler. Total party poopers, just like adults. Kids need adults. False. Kids need freedom, fun. Let loose and live it up. Adults are controlling and bossy. But adults keep children safe and protected. They care for their kids. They love them. Most adults do anyhow. You must bring the adults back. Nope, never. Know what? Since you care about these adults so much, why don't you go float with them for a while? What do you think you're doing, Bubbler? You're supposed to seize their miraculouses! Cataclysm! Couldn't you have said that 500 feet ago? We can't stay stuck in this bubble together forever! <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Cataclysm! <clears throat> Then cats aren't afraid of heights. We've got to get to his bubble sword. That's got to be where the Akuma is. We better hurry. Uh, where is everybody? Get out of here and party! Sorry to burst huh? your bubble. <laughs> Ladybug! 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 No one wants to party with you anymore, Bubbler. What's wrong with all you guys? Why you gotta be such haters? No! Space is the next stop for your precious peeps, and they're never coming back! Hey, nice party, I guess, since it's my first one. <laughs> I'm requesting a slow dance. It's a bit early for that, isn't it? Uh, well, no! For Adrian, his first slow dance. Mm? Oh, you know it, girl. Is it me, or does everyone seem a bit weird? Forget about them. Let's go uh, dance. Come on! Uh, there is no way this is happening. Lucky Charm! Record? Dude, who just hijacked my mix? Yours truly.